Hey guys, so today's video is just a week vlog. My life is really crazy, so I've just been filming it. I'm moving, moving out of a place, moving into a new place. And when I move in, there's some crazy stuff that goes down. So keep on watching. I hope you guys enjoy. All right, y'all, on today's episode, Tipsy Bartender, we got niggas in the cup. You take yourself some JMO, you get yourself a little bit of Diet Coke, you get the blood of a nigga, and you go ahead and squirt, squirt, give it a little star, star. <laughs> yeah! yeah! <laughs> Isabella and I are putting away some of these dishes and whatnot. Behind me, I see this. Yes. <laughs> Ty? Oh, and Ari's laying them? What? <laughs> Day two. Hey, y'all. It's July 3rd, and I am almost about to be officially moved out of my apartment. I look terrifying, and I was gonna let down my hair, but it's not gonna help. Yeah, I emptied out my apartment. And yeah, let's go Because I never really showed you like a full move-in tour. Um, I edited that video, I just never posted it. I don't know why. Stalkers, you know. But yeah, this is what it looks like empty. Alright, my hands are really shaky, but that's besides the point. You walk in, you know, have your washer and dryer, my little storage place, right? And my little island. Little kitchen moment, two bedroom girl. Way overpriced because when I moved in, in July, the prices were just super fucking high. This was my little glam area, and then my gaming area, and just my extra closet. That had so much shit in it that it was overflowing. All right, then we had my little guest bathroom. That was honestly amazing. Like this bath was like really nice. The water pressure was ass though, so I never used it. Then this like storage unit was honestly, I was like, oh this is the unit because i have a lot of shit especially toiletries anything that tiktok wants me to buy i end up buying so we move on from the living room that was honestly so small oh had a little balcony moment yeah it's a beautiful day in la right now and we had my bedroom aka the dungeon i absolutely hate anything that's ever happened in here this is where i spent a lot of time contemplating life <laughs> had my little projector set up right there oops had it going right there. And then I had my closet, which is literally just my shoes and my sweaters. And then my bathroom. It's way more ass than the other one, but I don't know, I like the layout more of like, my bed had to go in this room for sure, just so I could put my desk in the other. This was my only kitchen cabinet, which, which you'll see in the new house. Um, house, lieutenant, you'll see in the new house how huge the cabinet is. I'm not kidding, I literally had an air fryer stored in my guest bathroom. So I'm really excited to be moving out of here with my best friend slash sister, it's Tina Marie. <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna go give them the keys and I guess that's that on that. I don't wanna leave, but I also do because I had this like boo thing last year that like this apartment was right there. I would stare at it every day and I haven't thought about it once since I've been gone or I haven't thought about him once since I've been gone. Until I came here the other day and I was like packing, I was like, oh, I never have to look at that building and think of you again. Even though he's a great guy, wrong time, and not gonna happen. <laughs> I do wanna leave. I love my apartment. Could be bigger, could be better. Could have been decorated. Never really wanted to decorate it because it was so small. But just the AC in this bitch blasts. I miss it. But on to better things. Buy my apartment. Day three. Okay, so for reference, this next clip is literally us trying these little buzz ball things that like mess with like your taste buds. So that's what this is. Oh, and we were at dinner for Isabel's birthday because it was at midnight. It's a weird buzz bud for a second. Think of these. I like that. Oh my god. I turned this way like Oh my god. Oh my god. I need it to end. I don't like it. I need it's it like to I end. It's like I had a warhead. Yeah. No one said I, I had to swallow. But, my birthday's at midnight. Woo! Woo. Something is like cute. No, but you know what it is giving? You know those, um, you know those like... Warhead? Dick sucking men? No, no, no. Yeah, that's what you're solving. No way. Yeah. I meant to catch that. <laughs> I couldn't guess there was too much. I'm my ex-boyfriend sent me them and go I've had dry mouth all wait, week. Wait, 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 wait. Like I've right never now. tried one of those, but you know what I've tried? They're insane. The pop rocks that you put in like your mouth and then oral like you like- Oh wait, oral. Oh. I just bought pop rocks.
said he bought Britney Spears happy birthday. She did too. Day four. I'm flipping the cameras. It is not my fucking birthday. Hold on. This bitch's birthday, and she made me chug, but I'm pretty sure she's supposed to be the drunk one. So fucking go. And go. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, okay. You're not five years old. Keep going. You're 22. <laughs> Keep going. She's looking at me so mean, but I get it. <laughs> Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. You're not 13. You wouldn't be able to, <laughs> to drink. Bring me, bring. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. Almost there. You're 22, bitch. Drink another one. I'm 21. 21. <laughs> Happy 21st. You feel better, I right? wanted a picture of it. You'll get another. That's true. <laughs> Baby. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. 3.28 a.m. Yeah, I just got woken up out of my bed. Sorry, I'm like, I would do it bonnet on. I know you wouldn't. If it was any other, other instance, I would. Isabella, <laughs> just call me. Finish that now. I'm trying. It's so delicious. How could you go? <laughs> oh, my God. Isabella, just called me freaking out. Like, texted me up the ass. Meanwhile, I'm trying not to get hacked on um, Facebook. A whole nother thing. Whatever. Shut the fuck up your Facebook. Um, well, I, like, I have nothing anymore. So, Isabella texted me, like, like I'm, I feel like chocolate right now. Like, I really want chocolate, but I just brushed my teeth. Like, ugh, whatever. She just found some, like, chocolate that were, like, left in the fridge. And they, like, look, like, so rich, so yummy. Like, looks like a rich-ass brand. Like, Hero. What is it? Hero Artisan Luxury Chocolates. Mint flavor, like, mint chocolate amazing whatever they taste incredible right so like 20 minutes later 30 minutes later she's blowing me up on my phone and i'm like trying to not get hacked on facebook and she calls me and she's like actually look at your text look at your text she's like what and she's like i think i'm on acid i think i need i think there was mushrooms in the chocolate i'm like there's no way i come down here I'm like, maybe she's manic or something i come down here and i like look at the chocolates and i like look them up and it's like the website already is like what age are you and i'm like uh oh <laughs> So to make her feel better, I'm eating them with her. A lot of them, so we're on the same level. Even though it's just shrooming in Turks, and I'm like, fuck. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to vlog this experience. Why do people willingly do this? <laughs> She's never taken mushrooms before. I just want to know how you ate so much. These are expired and- They're expired? This has to be illegal. Well, look at this packaging. Okay. Hero Artisan Luxury Chocolates, right? Okay, say less. First thing I did notice though when I came down here was the 57 grams, but I'm like, okay, 57 grams, that two ounces of chocolates, yeah. It doesn't really honestly say if that is in correlation to mushrooms, but anyways, in the end, it's not the years in your life that count, it's the life in your years. Abraham Lincoln. Yeah, it doesn't honestly say, oh wait, and then you close this. One taste of this rich handcrafted dark chocolate proves hero has no equal. And then I look at the ingredients and I'm like, all right, let's go. First things first. Okay, cacao, cane sugar, cocoa butter, hero blend, functional mushrooms. Uh -oh. I thought that was like Yeah, that's what honestly I thought too. And maybe it is. Um, so now here we are. This is not what I wanted, but I will say that when I am annoying someone, this is how I feel. This much joy. So that's good. Like, that's why we were, like, when we were in Turks and we were all shrooming, we just kept, like, giggling at each other. <laughs> but, like, we guys thought this much. No, I, we did. You guys brought those to Turks? Natalie did. Who knowingly knew that these were mushrooms? No one. Amari's taken, like, or has eaten some of these chocolates before <laughs> and noticed nothing. When we, <laughs> oh, I can't even tell the story. When we just called him, we just called him to be like, yo, like, what the fuck? Like, you've taken these shrooms before and you never noticed anything? And he's like, oh, I guess that makes sense. I don't know. I guess it just felt like happy. He was unfazed. Yeah, he was completely unfazed. I feel like, I keep feeling like I need to take a deep breath. I don't like that. I, I'm the last kind of person to want this. <laughs> Ever. And to think that I was just happy. A nice little sweet before, <laughs> before bed. I literally did everything to go to bed. I brushed my teeth and I was like, you know what? No, I'm gonna have chocolate. <laughs> and this was the only one that was close. It was, it was the closest one to me. So I was like, you know what? Fuck, I'm gonna have those. I thought they were so bougie that they had to be like <laughs> opened like that. But it's like, I'm on the verge of like laughing my ass off or like sobbing. And I don't think that's normal. No, that is normal. <laughs> Update.
So Isabella initially made me take like a nibble, but then she's like, no, you have to be on the level that I'm on. But I like am very sensitive to mushrooms and she ate half the bar, but we're not gonna tell her that. I took a whole row of the bar and plus like whatever nibbles she didn't finish. So God knows what I'm on, but I got my Michelada's on deck. But y'all, let me just, I'm shrooming. Hold on, let me flip the camera. I mean, okay. We have this Santal candle that I got Tana for Christmas. But when I tell you that this is like rising and going down and up and going down and up for me, like, I'm shrooming. Anyways, let's crack this open together. Honestly, I feel like my pupils aren't like hella dil dilated, which I feel like that's like when you're shrooming hella, but. This table is like breathing. That makes no sense. But like to me, I'm like. Oh, you guys. So like Ashley and I's hyperfixation has been Michelada's mm -hmm. ever before. since she's she's been moving into this house. I just like recently like loved them. Michelada's. And Isabella needs to catch up tonight. So I feel like a crackhead. Okay, wait. Anyways, long story short, she needs a shotgun this because she needs to catch up, which is going to be so like. And we're officially caught up. I might have taken more mushrooms than her, so go. Just go. Oops. Girl, what? Why'd you pour it out? Just kidding, I'm like... Take it away. Which is not. <laughs> Update y'all, God knows what time it is, but the sun is out. Isabella made me take my bonnet off. It's apparently right there. We're playing Mario Kart and I'm still slaying. I got second because of this rat Wendy decided to do a sneaky move. I should have been in first place, but I got second, not bad for shrooms. 12 seconds later. How do you feel? No, no. Chug this? Oh, yeah. Tornado. Isabella, you're telling me I can't chug that? No, I said, I said do it. Tornado, tornado, tornado. Three, two, one. I want to suck his dick. Swirl, swirl. Sorry, that was a joke. <laughs> swirl! Fair enough. I wanted to see the tornado. I've seen you do that just so bad. Oh my god. Claire? Oh no. Oh, oh, oh my, he might pull into Mari. Never. <laughs> Never. 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 <laughs> Many unbearable hours later. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys do like the vlogs, let me know and I will definitely keep posting because I've been filming a lot lately and there's a lot to update you guys with and whatnot. So yeah, let me know if you guys want to keep seeing the vlogs. Crazy stuff is always happening and the next vlog is even crazier. So let me know if you guys want to see it. I love you guys so much and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye guys. Uh. Yeah.